Good morning. Oh no, I forgot my watch. I have to get my watch. Okay, I've got three microphones going on in here right now. I'm wearing a lavalier mic. I have my Zoom mic down in the cup holder, and I have my iPhone down between my legs. Although I suppose I'm gonna try to move my iPhone to be as close as possible to the Zoom mic so the location doesn't affect the difference in quality of sound. The main purpose of this test is to see which of these microphones does a better job of isolating my voice away from the background noise of the car. So here's some background noise of just the car. Now I'm gonna try to talk more softly and see if any of the mics do a better job of capturing a more soft-spoken approach. I should have taken the freeway because that would be an even better test. At around 75 miles per hour, the exhaust in this car gets really loud and droney. So I'm curious what that sounds like with all these different mics. I suppose it's also worth testing how the sound changes as I turn my head in different directions. My palm is itchy. This is probably enough testing for now. It's a doggy. It's a dog. Hi, doggy. It's a dog vlog. Say hi, dog. Uh, we're gonna film some SciShow. It's an episode about chemicals, chemicals in food. I am now walking to Boom Swagger, which is the place I get my hair cut, so I can get a haircut. It's gotten kind of unwieldy and unmanageable as of late, so we're gonna get that fixed. Haircut complete, now it's back to work. I'm exploring uh, solar powered options for recharging batteries and I asked a question that confused the employees. But Claire found a hat. Look how cute it is, it has a bear. <laughs> oh hey, are you bleeding? Nice hat. Thanks. I've got an omelet and broccoli. Ooh. How, how low carb have you been lately? I haven't had any carbs today. But like, yeah. yesterday. Yesterday I had ice cream. <laughs> From where? Sweet Peaks. Mm. So it was a coconut fudge sundae without the fudge. Mm -hmm. So Henry is currently showing me the, the things necessary for backpacking. In summer. In the summer. I assume winter is significantly different. Yeah, or spring or fall. Okay. Because uh, we're going to do a backpacking thing this weekend. And I've never done that before. I'm a newbie. You want me to throw it out on the carpet so there's more visible and better light? Okay. Oh, I've knocked all over the water. So this, in no particular order, whatever order is in my hands, is like a long underwear, a winter hat. For the summer? Yeah, if you get cold, you want a hat to keep you warm. Okay, okay. Uh, just a fleece top, wool socks, synthetic t-shirt, lightweight gloves, which is also in case you get cold, poly pro top. And I have these like windproof, waterproof glove cover things because mm. my hands get extra cold. So those are nice, but not required. Anything else, Alex? That looks like pretty- Tracking poles. Tracking pole? Tracking poles. Oh, it's a tracking pole. Trekking poles, not- Trekking. Trekking. Pull down, pull from below. I assume they, they stay more rigid than that when you're using them. just like this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, interesting. Look at that technology. Hey, look, it's Montana. So, on our camping trip, we're gonna go there. <laughs> from, so, you're saying that we're gonna go from right there to right, to there. right there. Yeah. Wow. So, how many hours are we looking at of going in? Well, the shortest way in is about 10 miles of walking. Okay. And how many thousand feet of climbing? It goes up to around almost 8,000 feet there, and this is about 3,600. <laughs> I'm not even really sure what just happened. There was a banana. There was a banana, and then there wasn't.